Yeah, yeah good luck. All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another Windy Wednesday Nighter. And this one is a special one. This is the TOC. Everything that we've been working towards all year happens tonight. So, we're excited. Pops is in the boat. So you know what that means? The old drop shot king himself is back. That means I ain't got a single one of those tied up. I am going to specifically focus on punching, frogging, doing something that I know a big fish will eat. So I think tonight, if you're gonna win, you're gonna have to have that big stick in your hand. And having a, a fishing partner with you that can catch the other fish uh, is, is key. So we're just gonna go out there, have a good time. Predictions? Well, the last uh, month it's all been in that high 18 pound range. So yeah. I, I probably think probably somewhere around that 18 to 20. Yeah, I think it's probably gonna take 20 to 21 to win tonight. So stumble across the, across the right bank with the right grass, you'll hook into them. So stay tuned, let's get to fishing. Well, just made it to our first spot. What a gorgeous day out here on the river. It is hot and the tide just switched. We're at a low tide right now, incoming the rest of the night. Should have a lot of water in the system today. And it's full moon, anything could happen. And like I said, I think having that big rod in the hand is gonna get us a big bite. So I'm gonna be doing a lot of flipping, punching, frogging, hoping for a big one. Oh yeah, huge shout out. Got another new member, MJD Fishing. Thank you, appreciate it, buddy. And another member, he said, don't shout me out, you don't need to, but uh, you know what? I'm gonna send him a free t-shirt, so. You never know, you can get some baits, you can get t-shirt, hit that little sub button. Appreciate it, guys. Let's get to fishing. Well, as you can see, I've got two punch rigs, frog chatter, and a whopper plopper. Hoping that's all we need tonight. They just have not been eating the frog, have they? I just saw a six pounder. I just saw a six pounder under the mat. He flashed, he's right on, he was right in that open hole. Like, I just saw his tail. Just chilling right on the edge of this mat. Oh gosh, I thought he picked it up. That was a big fish. Yeah, that's a good start. Little two pounder. Uh oh. What worm did you catch that on? <laughs> it was a Cinco. Oh, uh, it was a Cinco this time. You're upgrading. Heck yeah. First keeper of the day. I'm dedicating this fish to Uncle Don and Aunt Fern. Thanks guys for watching. Love you.
little guy. Oh, broke your worm in half. Yeah. Yeah, you're gonna catch a lot of those today. Oh my gosh. That was like one of the biggest bites I've felt punching this year. Could have been, but geez, he just straight up just like stopped it like a linebacker. That was crazy. It shocked me it hit it so hard. It was like I was hitting like solid concrete or something. You have to jig this thing a lot in order to get him to eat. See, I had to. Ooh, that orange crawdad, you just spit out. That's, That's my bait. bait. That's your bait. Well, that's a better one. And you have to like jig it like seven million times in order to get them to eat. First one on the old punch rig. Nice healthy dark fish. Crawdad down at the gullet. Number two. that on like the fifth pump I think it's a good one felt like it had some weight behind it He's off? Yeah. How? We just saw him shaking. Yeah. Dang it. Oh, we just saw him shaking. Crap. That one felt like it had some weight to it. Well, it's kind of the downside of punching though, right? so many casts that I'm not making no. on this bank. Oh. That one I freaking sent it to the moon. Just a slight tick on the way down. Good 
You never know how tonight's gonna go, so I would put them in the box. Is that our fifth? Church on the fourth. This bite has been very finicky today, that's for sure. And it's a it's a full moon today too, so you'd think. Think they'd be chewing. It's a, it's a cooking out here today. Well, we just put our fifth fish into the box. Granted, there are uh, five small ones. We've got one decent one in there, but uh, we're definitely needing to upgrade. Uh, so far, tide really hasn't been moving a whole lot. Just started moving about 30 minutes ago, but these fish are just a little uh, tight-lipped, I think. They're, they're not they're not biting like crazy um, and they're just kind of pecking at the the punch rig they're not really engulfing it and when they do it's kind of hard to feel it they just barely just kiss it on the bottom so we're gonna keep grinding we're about two hours in wish us luck we need a couple big ones wouldn't that be nice to take home the old toc think we're gonna do it pops Got to fish with confidence, you know? There's a punch fish, that'll cool. Not by much, but it'll cool something. Yeah, he beat the heck out of that uh, way down. Yeah, might be a good idea to weigh him then. No, I can't. <laughs> First cool. Yeah. Still shaking. That'll help. That'll definitely help. Hey! Pop's caught two fish. Pop's got two fish punching. Heck yeah. And good ones too. That looks exactly like the one I lost last week. Really? Yeah. Hmm? Sweet. Oh, are we staying here? Look at the coal. <laughs> yeah. That's a great coal. <laughs> Dogging you. Wow. Jump pups. Another coal.
Number four. Yeah. Pretty decent coal. Yep. Oh yeah. All right. Last call. Final moments out here fishing during the windy Wednesday nighters of the year. It's a little bittersweet right now. We got a beautiful sunset in the background, slick, calm conditions. <sighs> 45 minutes left of fishing. Who knows what can happen, right? Any cast. Let's get it. One hour later. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we had a good run, gave it our best shot. Got a small limit. Let's see what everyone else has. That's why I told Pops to get in the line first. Weigh our 10 pounds and lick our wounds. Nice. 481. Good. Has five, weighing a big one. It. Come on, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Maybe two pounds. It's all right. With the boat behind you or the boat in front of you? The boat behind it. Oh, okay. Oh, I was 305. Three pounder. Right. You found one. Yeah. Lake side pot going. Hey, whatever side Come on, Dennis. There you go. We say the big one for last. Okay, okay, let's see. 1127. Five. Yeah. Yeah, just. Five fish, weighing the big one. She's thick. That's a five pounder all day. Maybe. Weighing the big fish. Six fourteen. Dang. That was thick. You guys uh, won AOI for Tuesdays, right? Yeah. Congratulations. Thank you. But it's Ouch. something. Came to play tonight. Yep. Solid bag. Yeah, you did. Yeah, we'll see what it does. Finally, finally got in the boat. What bit? Imagine that. That has been a struggle a out here, dude. Why, why did, why did you dude, I've gone home almost crying. Yeah. Is it 19? Oh, it's all day. Yeah. 1990. Good job. Good job. Good job, guys. Pretty sure this is way over five. Oh yeah, it's a big one. <laughs> we were here till three twenty. We were here today. Six oh seven. And then another team for the rod. 1498. There you go. Good job, guys. Yep. Another solid bag. Yo. Never had a chance for one. Fifteen 
98. Do it first. Uh, no, we didn't get anything bigger than that. We just got all those. Okay, That's nice. Me. Glad you can make it out. Yeah, it was cool. Break this one. Five wheel is a perfect one. Fifteen oh six. Heck yeah! That's a solid bag. Yeah. Five. Is it fatty? Be close. Oh yeah. Six fifty two. Yep. New big. New big. Oh, I got another good one to go with it. That was a mistake. <laughs> Jeez Louise. They're shedding ounces. This is a bag right here. <laughs> They're the last one, man. Yeah, I know. <laughs> it happens. It happens every week. I'm happy with it. I think. Yeah, that's the best you have done so far, I think. Yeah. That's yeah. For sure. Long time. Twenty forty-seven. Hey, there you go, guys. Good job, guys. Thanks, man. Thanks. Wayne, the big one. He's got five. Sub one. Sub one. Sub mark. Five sixty-six. Uh oh. Uh oh, it's another bag coming. Another bag. Oh yeah. Huh. We're gonna break bad. the 21 pound mark, huh? Yes, I guess I am. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Where these bags been all year? 21.97. Job one. All right, 14.43 to get paid. Okay, we're gonna do the certificates for CNC Marine. Two fifty dollars certificates first. I guess all the names of that envelope say Richard and Jerry. Yeah. No, just twenty of them. <laughs> Adrian and Dean. Adrian and Dean. Oh, shit. Draw another name. I get my wallet out because it's coming out of my pocket. Juan and VJ. Juan and VJ or Juan and Mark. What do we get? More cash? A hundred more dollars. Oh, yeah. This hurts. Take it. This hurts. Wow. Thank you. <laughs> oh my gosh, really? You gotta call them up. Justin and Cliff. Hey. Justin, winner, winner, chicken there dinner. Go. There you go. Thank you. Good job, you guys. Even though you didn't do that, but draw me. <coughs> Jake and Dennis. Hey, oh. hey. 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 <laughs> yeah, we know it's Rick. Rick. Thank bucks. you. Good job. Woo. Hey, one more, one more hundo. That's for me. That's my casa. Ryan Cole. Oh, there he is. He stuck around. <laughs> Come on, Rich. You could have called. Can you unstrap those rods for me. And that now we're gonna give away two Phoenix rods. Unstrap those rods. Thanks. Good job, man. Caleb and Pop. Yeah. <laughs> can I pull my own? You can. If you pull you it can out. if you pull it out. Oh, come on. <laughs> Bill and Aaron. Oh, come my on, God. Seriously? Oh. <laughs> hey, thank you all for coming out this year. Appreciate you guys. All right, that is a wrap for Wendy Wednesday Nighters 2023. Man, what a run Pops and I had. It was, it was a good season. It was a good season. We both had, we had two wins together, uh, quite a few in the money finishes, two solo money finishes. We had a pretty good run at the Wendy Wednesday Nighters this year, but you know, what do we do on the last one? We sucked. <laughs> no, we we probably had about 12 pounds. Just uh, 
running around searching for that big bite and couldn't find it. And uh, I did what I said I was gonna do. I kept that big rod in my hand, the big punch stick, and the fish just were not cooperating. Um, Pops caught them pretty good. I was missing fish left and right. For some reason they were just pushing the bait or bumping it or nosing it or just trying to kill it, not actually inhaling it. And that's how it goes, right? And that's fishing. That wraps up one of the best midweek tourneys, I believe, in the U.S. Windy Wednesday Nighters, if you guys aren't doing this, you should really check it out next year. We're averaging roughly 45 to 55 boats. I'd like to see it 60, 70 next year. More boats, the more payout. Oh, it's just a good way to break up the work week. I say it over and over again. But without further ado, jump into the results. Let's see how everybody did. So we had 44 boats tonight. Two of them didn't enter the Wednesday nighter. They just wanted to fish a TOC, so they didn't get into the money on that side. But 44 boats total. It took 14.43 to get paid. Seventh place was Tyler and Clay with 14.43. Sixth was Steven and Dennis with 14.56. And actually, Steven and Dennis, they actually weighed in a decent bag. They had a little over 15. They ended up having a dead fish penalty, so that hurt them. But those guys did it out of the old 10 rig, the old duck boat. So that's pretty cool. You don't need no fancy glitter sled to get you out there and, and cast a check. Fifth place was T-Bone and Adrian. They had 14.98. They weighed in a big fish. It was like six pounder. Missed out on some big fish money, but still solid finish in the TOC. Fourth place. Dave Cole and Ron Silk, they had 15.98. Third was Phil and Aaron, they had 19.90. So for third place, the previous tournaments, 19 pounds has been winning. 19 to 20 pounds has been winning, but we had three bags over 19 pounds. They saved it to the last day. Second was Drew and Wyatt, they had 20.47, and they also had big fish of the tournament with a 6.52. And first place, Juan Acosta and Mark Gomez, these guys are hammers, sticks out here on the Delta. They won the Windy Wednesday Nighter TOC with 21.97, and they had, oh no, they didn't have a big fish. They just had a solid bag. Um, and then second big fish went to Phil and Aaron. They had 6.14. So Phil and Aaron, they got third place and second big fish. Truly, truly just want to say thank you guys for following along on this series. Yeah, met a lot of new faces in the parking lot, met a lot of new people that are showing up to these, and every one of you guys are saying keep up the good work. I, I do really, really appreciate you guys. That's the, reason why we, that's the reason why we film, and we do what we do, because it's fun, it's entertaining, and we want to bring you guys along for the ups, the downs, the rights, the lefts, the pops putting me up for adoption, and you know, me catching big fish on a pink worm. So stay tuned for the next one. Hope you guys truly enjoyed the 2023 season. Until next year with these Windy Wednesday Nighters, just remember, any cast be a giant. Peace.